guys welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is Brianna and today I'm back with another Lush review and this time around I have the Heavenly Massage Bar and this massage bar is in the very very famous Vanillary scent family it's been a mainstay at Lush for many many years and yeah I can't wait to get into this review and tell you all about it now I'm just looking down at my little notes it is from the japan kitchen in 2017 so yeah that's where i got this from but it has been um in and out of lush's product range long before that but yeah this is my version the 2017 version so let's get into it so this product has cocoa butter fair trade shea butter it's got extra virgin coconut oil perfume vanilla absolute Jasmine Absolute, Tonka Absolute, and Gardenia Extract. So pretty simple ingredients list. I have sort of surmised it a little bit from the internet. There's a few more bits and pieces in there as well. So like I said, this does have the very famous vanillary scent. I, oh, I just love the vanillary scent. It's one of my favorite things at Lush. Uh, the vanillary perfume is one of my favorite perfumes that I own. I think it's simply fantastic. Um, and to me, it smells almost like a, I wouldn't call it a bakery vanilla per se, but it does have that very sort of no-nonsense vanilla scent to it. It's not overly sweet. It doesn't smell like, you know, an Ariana Grande perfume, which tends to have very sickly sweet vanilla in it, if you've ever smelt an Ariana Grande perfume. Um, it's just this really nice, clean grown-up vanilla scent I would say now in terms of the florals in there the jasmine and the gardenia I don't tend to pick up like distinctly floral in this like when I smell it I don't think oh this smells like florals there is a little bit of a point of difference that it does give the scent but you don't instantly smell this and think yes it smells like florals at least I don't anyway uh, now the Tonka Absolute does add another edge to the fragrance again because Tonka is a vanilla kind of scent but it it acts in a very similar way to the Sleepy Twilight scent and how it has Tonka in it as well it just sort of gives it a more creamy smell and a more richer vanilla in my opinion so you are getting a very rich clean vanilla scent in a way and it's very just vanilla that's pretty much all you really need to know it's just a beautiful interpretation of a vanilla scent and it's definitely one of my favorites i think it is probably my favorite vanilla scent that i've ever tried in my entire life i think it's just perfect for a clean no nonsense vanilla scent it's great all right enough of that but anyway like I said, it is definitely an amazing scent. And the best part about this massage bar, even all, uh, after all these years, it just, it probably smells as good as it was the day it was made. It just smells excellent. Now there has been a little bit of a color fading on the little Lush here, but I love the design of this product. This is beautiful product design, obviously with that sort of tattoo style, um, what do you call it, banner, I guess, over the heart, I think it is. A really nice product design as well as with most uh, massage bars from Lush getting my words tied up uh, as with most of them it glides on really really nicely onto the skin it's not overly greasy I found that this one I would say maybe it is a little bit more greasy than some of the others but it does go pretty quickly I feel it does take that just that little bit of extra time to sink into the skin not sure why it's just something that i have discovered but i really don't care that much it's a very tiny difference in the product what i will say is if you don't like vanilla definitely don't buy this product um big warning don't buy this product because the strength of the scent is insane it is on the same level as the love potion which i just recently reviewed as well you will smell like this all day. So I would recommend foregoing perfume altogether, to be honest with you, because you will just smell delicious with this on. Uh, you could always just layer up and add a little bit of vanilla, 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 <laughs> gosh, I'm doing terrible, but I've got to keep going. Um, a little bit of vanilla to the top part of your body. Cause I generally use massage bars on my legs. I don't know about you guys. 
I generally use them on my legs more than anywhere else. Um, so yeah, you could always just add a little bit to your body or even something else that's quite sweet, like say Butterball, which is another favorite of mine, which is a chocolate vanilla scent. That would work really well with this as well. Uh, you just don't want to overdo the perfume and other things when you use this product is what I'm really trying to say. Um, what else can I say? That's pretty much it. I've talked about everything that needs to be talked about. Rating. I think you guys can pretty much guess what I'm going to say. It's a definite five out of five product. Definitely one of my favorite massage bars that I have ever tried at Lush. 100%. It is completely up my alley. The scent is perfect. The strength of scent is really in your face and over the top. It's like, thank you very much for that. <laughs> thank you, Lush. Um, I really enjoy this product. I think the design's beautiful. I think the name says all you need to know about the product. It is heaven, vanilla heaven. Love it. Perfect. So very happy with it. I would definitely buy 10 of these if they re-release this tomorrow. I think it's worth it. It is a really, really nice interpretation. And it's even nicer than, say, Cream Anglaise body lotion, which I love the Cream Anglaise body lotion, which is not the same scent. It's a very similar scent. Uh, it's like a spicy vanilla. Um, and I really, really like the scent of that. And even the Vanilla Delight Body Lotion, which is another one of my favorites that I love, I still prefer this. I think this is the best version of vanilla -y besides the perfume um, that I've come across anyway in any product that I've used. So, yeah, very happy with it and really enjoyed it. Mm. So thank you very much for watching this review. I really appreciate it. Please let me know if you've tried this product down below in the comments. I know one of you was saying that I would really love it. Um, I think it might have been you, Amanda. Um, and yes, you're right. I do love it. Uh, but yeah, let me know if you've tried it as well. Uh, but until next time, take care and I do hope to see you again. Bye for now.